not gonna lie, today went by a lot faster than expected and my battery's gonna die. Okay, now I need to charge it before I start recording. That's great. Okay. Okay, I just kind of want to show you guys what I'm dealing with in my office. So, here, don't worry guys, my hands are clean, like, as always. Um, but we have a lot of CEO lip gloss, and right now, I just kind of have all my lip glosses in boxes. And the reason why is because I feel like this is not durable enough anymore. And I find it very frustrating because I really like the look of it. And I like how when I'm filming videos, it's just white it's simple it's clean it's minimalistic y'all like this literally is not durable like this pops off like and those are like my squeeze tubes for clarity lip gloss but i don't know i really thought like right now i just kind of have things that are light uh my hydro flask but things that are just kind of light like bubble mailers the light stuff like my business cards some tape and my lash boxes i do plan on getting rid of this because i don't want my lip glosses to just be in boxes you know like i want them to be displaced nicely but yeah i just kind of wanted to rant on that a little bit and sometimes when i have extra extra gloss space i'll just like leave a little bit how here like when i make more i'll just like use this and like fill it up like fill up the rest this is ceo lip gloss base and then we have the thrive body foaming sugar scrub i'm honestly so obsessed with the way it looks it's so freaking pretty and underneath here i just have more scrubs and more of the turmeric facial soap minis um let me see if I can do it with one, I have really bad wrists because of volleyball. I already showed you guys the facial soap minis. This, my friend, is the Manifest Body Foaming Scrub. This one is mellow, very popular. It smells like you're on a cloud. That's how people are describing it. Um, what else? This is Adorad lip gloss base. This is like not full yet, but until I make more, I'm gonna fill up the rest of it. More to my facial soap minis. I'm really making sure that I stuck up on these before I release because I really do feel like people are really really gonna love it and it actually takes a long time to make one. Oh my gosh you guys have no idea how much work I put into that um more manifest this one's gonna be new honestly I'm not gonna lie this is really red and I'm really worried that it's gonna stain so I'm not really gonna like and I'm like I should have been more careful too because I made like not a lot of these, but a fair amount to realize that, like, damn, I think I might have just wasted product because I think I put too much pigment. <sighs> Whatever. Okay. Um, but yeah, let's just kind of, like, a sneak peek on what's going on here. So your girl got sponsored by Office Depot and I'm so freaking excited because you guys 
kept you guys kept listening to how annoyed I was of this thingy mobile but like at the same time I love it because it gives me such a clean presentation when I'm recording and I got myself three of them and I just have all my inventory laid out and number two it makes it easier for me like for my back because like let's say I want to sit let's say I just want to sit and just package orders instead of standing up it's not gonna hurt my back because I won't be reaching down for the boxes that I had the products in before all my lashes are down there so that's even like better and I really like how I have like a little color scheme going that's like my thing for my lashes is everything's like the same packaging but it'll come in different colors depending on the lash style so these were my originals my Haina lashes a little dramatic it gives you kind of like a cute muñeca type of look I was wearing before I decided on this lash style I was literally wearing them to the nail salon and this girl said, oh my gosh, like, I love your lashes. She asked, like, oh, are those, like, strip lashes or did you actually get them done? And I was like, no, these are, like, they're just false lashes. And she was like, oh my god, they look so freaking real. And I'm like, oh my god. So ever since that experience, I decided to go with these because it made an impression on a stranger. And when I feel like something makes an impression on a stranger, it's worth it. Like, it's worth to invest in. So, I got that style. I haven't named that one yet. Let's go with this one. I probably should have organized this a little better. But you know what? It's okay. I named these ones Amorcito Lashes. And, I don't know. I really like these ones because I feel like they complement my eye shape. And I feel like they would look really good on hooded eyes as well. Adjustable to my eyes. Like, I can cut them down to, like my eye shape or eye size or whatever i didn't even know that i had extra of enamorada and kiss me again lip gloss like what so i'm gonna put that back in my shop super soon why is this not focusing and then down there is just like my body scrubs or oh, no, no no that's audacity wholesale this is and some of there is audacity care and up here is audacity care and then the rest of this is like audacity cosmetics and these ones were just kind of like a fun little project but I'll sell these for like honestly three dollars and this is like 15 millimeters worth um honestly I was trying to create like a cute little ombre effect and to an extent this looks kind of like a little marble thing going on but I just I don't know but the color is cute and the texture is amazing oh my god I'm so bloated because I just ate but this is what we have so far barely a dent into what I have left to do obviously because all of this and all of that let me move my jacket all that is sold out so when I'm done packaging all this gotta be gone is basically what I'm saying I'm debating whether I just want to go take this batch now so that way I have more space or just like wait and if I have to ship these out tomorrow I will but, I don't know. I think I might just take them, to be honest, because this is, this is a lot. Okay, so those are the packages that were on the couch before, and I put them in bags, and here's another batch. Okay, so I got some regular trash bags because all of my huge tubs are currently being used because okay I'm not cluttered but it's just I need space and because I started another business um that that bucket is like holding all of my ingredients and tub like basically all my materials for my body care line um so in the meantime I'm gonna be using trash bags Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. I just ran out of uh, bubble mailers, but I have another box of 250 bubble mailers in my room. So we're gonna put these babies in here. Come on. This is really hard to do with one hand, you guys. Okay. And I think we can fit. this there 
maybe this in here. That side down. And just Okay, and I'm gonna take this inside. I'm gonna leave this in my living room. So by the time I go drop off orders, I'll be ready. Okay, now I just brought this new box over. Again, this is really hard to do one-handed and my battery's literally about to die, so I'm gonna rush. But for satisfying reasons. Oh, wait. Come on. Yeah, for satisfying reasons, you guys love it when I open stuff, so there you go. Okay, you guys, so wait, what time is it? It's 1 a.m. I'm tired, I'm tired, I'm tired. But my system right now is to kind of just lay out every single label just like this in order so we got Miriam, Adriana, Brittany, Graciela packing slip in order oh this was a long one anyway, thank you packing slip in order then goes Brittany, then goes Vida. Okay. And then I just start laying them out like this. That's CEO, Prodigy, Passionate, Vida, Adorar. And then one do that each for the remaining orders. It's Monday. We're gonna take out the packages now. <sighs> this is gonna be a lot. I need another bag or like two. I'm gonna get two more bags. Okay, this is what we are looking like. And the rest of it's still in the office. This is censored. Okay. Ooh. Receipt. Oh, I have to get in the habit of like not leaving little things in my car, but we're gonna start off by, actually we're gonna put, no. Okay, I'm gonna put this in the front. Okay, that's the front. This is the back. And we're gonna go get the rest of it, but even though I live like down there, I still feel like I need to lock it because you never know. You guys, it's hella hot. Now I'm wearing sweatpants, but you know what? It's okay. Oh, I forgot. That one's locked. Wait, I don't need to open that door. I stood up pretty late last night, so I'm not surprised my brain cells don't make sense right now. Okay, I'm really hot. I mean, of course I am. I'm just gonna open it. Um, I really wanted to make a TikTok video, but I can't because my phone's gonna die, and you guys know how it is, like, when you're recording and, like, when your phone's just about to die, it's, like, really shuddery and it's glitchy. And I don't like that. I love how summer gets at its hottest right when summer's about to end. Like that. That doesn't make sense to me. Um, but my skin is doing pretty good. Like I said, the turmeric facial soap minis are launching very soon. Okie dokie. So we're here. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go and let them know that I'm going to be going around the back. 
Uh, just so they're expecting me and just so like I'm not knocking on their back door like a crazy person, so. Honestly, I really do love my seats. I love how my Alcantara seats just really like accentuate the moment. I was knocking on the wrong door, you guys. Embarrassing. I was knocking on the wrong doors. Oh, that was so embarrassing. But thanks for watching, everybody. But yeah, like, comment, and subscribe. I'm really happy that you guys love to watch my videos and I do read people's comments. I'm working on replying to as many of you as I can. But ooh, Kia, what is you doing? But yeah, have a good morning, good afternoon, and a good night from wherever you are in the world. Bye, chicas.